822 on this Sunday morning and another school year is just weeks away of course and many parents and kids they're getting ready and gathering all those supplies they'll need in the classroom but some children they don't have those resources because they're homeless. PIMCO Insurance's Allison Leap joining us here this morning to tell us about a back to school event that we can all get behind. Good morning Allison and thanks for being here. Good morning thanks for having me. Yeah so let's talk about this event. What are PIMCO and the South Lake Union community doing this year? Well at, at PIMCO our mission is to free our communities to worry less and live more. That's everything from providing the right insurance policy to cover your valuables to bridging the gap for homeless students. And so that's exactly what we're doing with this back to school drive. It's called our supply surge and we will be supporting Seattle's middle and high schools with the highest number of homeless students. But we're not doing it alone. Okay. We have a mighty super team behind us. We have in all 32 wow. South Lake Union businesses coming together, linking arms with us to make a huge difference for these homeless students. Um, we, we all believe that they need our help and support. We're going to do what we can. In fact, we know we can make a big impact. Um, last year, we had 28 businesses join mm -hmm. us. We collected over 100,000 wow. items wow. to support nearly 6,000 students. So uh, we know we can make a big difference and we want to do even, even more, more yeah. for more this year. Tell us about those kids that we're talking about here that need this help, that are in the worst situation sometimes. Sure, you know, the statistics are uh, really quite staggering. Um, in, in Washington, we actually rank eighth overall for states with the highest number of homeless students. Mm. So it's pretty devastating. That's about 40,000 homeless students. And then when you look at Seattle public schools, that number is upwards of 3,000 homeless students. And that's not counting those 6,000 kids in subsidized or low income housing. So right. the need is there, the need is great. Um, and it's those exact kids that are coming in empty handed. Yeah. And when we come in unprepared, truancy increases dropout rates increase and we know that that achievement gap gets bigger and bigger and graduation becomes that much more difficult. So these supplies really important here. Tell us about the Beautiful. types of supplies that they will be needing. What's the most important this year? Omar, honestly, we need just the basics, yeah. right? I mean, things like rulers and highlighters, dividers, binders, all of those things. Um, and because we are targeting middle and high schools, we also need things like scientific calculators. We also need things like composition notebooks. And so how does supply surge work? Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so PEMCO and our super team, those 32 businesses, really are just coming together to try and gather as many supplies as we can. And we're actually inviting anyone to join. You don't have to be in South Lake Union. You don't have to be in Seattle. Uh, so to make it easy for anyone to join, you can just head over to our donation site at PEMCO.com slash supply hyphen surge. Find PEMCO's name on there and shop. All you have to do is click and buy, super fast, super easy. Yeah. Um, if you already have some of these supplies or you like to go shopping on your own, you can also just drop it off at one of the participating businesses or uh, send a check to our headquarters in South Lake Union. You guys make it so easy. And when does all of this start? I'm excited to share the drive officially launches tomorrow. Okay. July 29th. It'll go through August 16th. So a three-week drive starting tomorrow. And we're going to break those records like we were talking about. Let's break those <laughs> records for sure. So supply surge kicking off tomorrow. That's a big day for you guys. Anything else folks out there at home need to know about this morning? You, it's easy for you to join. It's going to start tomorrow. You can do online. You can do donation bins at any of the 32 participating businesses. They're all here in South Lake Union. It's super easy, and it's going to make a big, big impact. But we need your help. This is a collective effort. Thank you so much, Allison, for being here, and we're going to make a difference this year. You can join in and get all the information right on our website at q13fox.com. Let's send things over back to Aaron.